Ich bin Sascha aus Berlin, Treska Welsers, hallo. Ich bin Paula aus Hamburg. Also mein Name ist Rainer und ich komme aus Frankfurt, oder? Ja, uh, tell us something about your, the coffee you choose. It's a Kenyan from Coffee Collective in Copenhagen. It's quite a fruity coffee. Ich habe mich für Costa Rica entschieden. Das ist aus der, der Region Alajuela von der Finca Las Lajas. Die Farm heißt La Perla Negra. I have some nice coffee roasted in Panama, from Panama, and I want to try it out in the Iro Press. Um, I've got some Melmist coffee from um, Brazil. It's Fazenda Camasim. I have coffee from the Spanish Stadt Coffee House Rai mitgebracht. Aus Kenia, aus Süden Kenia. The coffee wird bei 1800 Meter angebaut. It's a very schöner, fruchtiger Kaffee. Also, ich bin von Coffee Circle und um, Genau, das ist der Chiri Café. Der kommt aus Äthiopien, ist unser wild wachsender Kaffee. Ist relativ ähm, fruchtig und bin gespannt, was er sich heute ja, in der Aeropress rauszaubern lässt. The easiest way to explain quality coffee yeah. is that uh, it starts with with the farmer, and that the farmer, if uh, if they have a variety that's interesting, yeah. uh, an interesting kind of coffee, that it's grown well, yeah. um, that from then on every step only involves not screwing it up. Okay. So when 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 um, someone makes a coffee. They're yeah. not turning something that doesn't taste good into something that tastes good. Okay, yeah. You're trying to stay out of its way as much as possible and letting it show its natural attributes that are hopefully delicious. Not sweet clarity that you would, should get in a Kenya. It should be singing with a sweet juice punch. Tastes like burnt rubber. Uh, okay. yeah, like, but it's, it's, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's also more gentle on the tongue. Like it's more smooth. It's yeah. I just don't want to have to taste this one again next round. <laughs> Coffee only extracts itself when it wants to. I would definitely have to say number one. Wait a minute, it's too hot. Oh, but the over extraction is so unpleasant. <laughs> it's a little over. Even though those, I don't like the fermentations, but it's still dry, much cleaner. Tastes like a Ethiopian natural. This one is also a bit over extracted. No, it's the natural in it. Probably. I know, but I. So, one more also, there are Quakers in this one too that are making yeah. it feel dry. But this one's worse, I'm sorry. It's just the overall better cup. The defect on that brewing is bigger than the, the choice. The thing is, when this cools down, it should be really a much different Yeah, and this, it just gets horrible. Oh, this is true. The judges had a few problems in the last round in terms of once again it was the, um, the extraction. Overall, they decided to give first place to Kai and second place to Matt. Um, first place received obviously the Vario um, Grinder from Malcolm.
No country.